up? Me one of those days, just a relaxing day. Really nice out. See whatever bites here in Davie. Freshwater canals. Um, plan on just hopping over some bridges. Throw it under some pylons. If I'm not getting anything, maybe I'll walk some canals and try to get a snakehead. I wonder what that is. Nice snakehead. Woo! I think I got my pliers with me. Another snakehead, wow. Freaking place is loaded with them. I don't know how I lost my rubber part of the frog. <laughs> nah, man, this frog is a beast, too. Now I gotta walk to my truck anyways to get the frog. Oh my frog. <laughs> Woo! Yep. Yeah. yeah, these frogs kick ass. I didn't want to lose them. Luckily, I found them floating. Nice. swim away <laughs> damn I got destroyed my frog <sighs> what a mess that was cool though. first cast with this guy
not bad. Oh. Well, they all been about the same size. Last year, last year fishing this area, I, it was almost impossible to catch a snakehead. Now I'm catching freaking more snakeheads and bass all together. So <clears throat> definitely getting a problem here. Look how good that looks. It's got like a pink tint to it. I'll tell you, these are the best tasting freshwater fish there is. I don't think anything could compare it to it. It even tops a lot of saltwater fish down here. Um, but you see how invasive they are. I was trying to catch bass, peacocks, and even maybe some small snooks around those pylons. I got nothing. Even in the lily pads, I was just striking out. But today, the snakehead bite was crazy. But that's also crazy because last year I was uh, fishing the same area and I would catch no snakeheads. This year, it was just back to back to back. So I think there may be becoming a problem in that area. So I'll just keep fishing for them. Um, I don't mind eating one once in a while. You can see how good that looks. I'm going to blacken it. And it'll be good. This is very tasty. Thanks for watching.